mic test mic test my name is mike this is a mic test 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 It'll never Hey folks, Mike with Chasing Trail out here today on this Saturday. Beautiful day. A lot of people out here, unsurprisingly. Out here is Shane. It's gonna be a good day. Beautiful day. Beautiful dirt conditions too, this dirt. It's not muddy, but good tacky, not too dusty, a little bit of dust, but not horrible. It says most difficult. They call it graves because you die on it. Okay, go ahead. So that actually is pretty cool so far. I was thinking about the amount of work I must have gone into making trails like this, just given how dense. All the vegetation through here is. It's going to be a lot of work. Love these 302 strokes, man. They just lug. I didn't even have to clutch it there. Not too bad other than tiring, which is just a getting a shape issue. This is getting tight. Not much margin for error here. Probably why they call it graves. So take my time here. I ain't racing. My only goal, as always, is don't crash. Sure, it's kind of boring to watch, but that's just what I'm about. A lug machine. This ain't my daddy's two stroke. Look at that. It just will not stall. There was no clutch there. Not much commentary here. It's taking all my concentration on trails like this, so I don't have too much to say. Got some nice dirt through here at least. Nice change of pace from all the rock. Alright, we're going up four to Hang Glider Hill. Let's hope all the snow's melted. Woo! Oh, muddy. I got the perfect tire for that. It's IRC M5B, I think it is. Shane had me get for precisely these conditions. Wow, they smoothed this all out. Used to be pretty rough through here. Oh, it's a lot better through here now. 
Damn Shane's hauling ass. Look at that guy. Halfway up the hill already. He's an animal. Lug it, baby. Lug it. Lug it. Whoop, 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 whoop. Lug it. These 302 strokes are badass. Hard for me to imagine a better dirt bike for out here. Between the weight, the suspension, and the lugability, these things are incredible. A little slippery, a little greasy. Holy shit, no one up here. That's unusual. Here's they see some people up here. Look at that view. Can't beat that. All right, hang glider hill. Oh, come on, baby. Making our way down to the back side. Or the front, yeah, I guess this is the back. I used to always come from Copley. Which this is heading down to Copley. I quit parking over there. There's been so many thefts. People getting the shit stolen out of their truck and their catalytic converters cut off. It's a really small staging area. And there's nobody on site. So easy for thieves to get away with shit versus the dam which always has a ton of people and there's a guy that lives on site never been on this trail sheep trail oh that's a lot of rocks i was banging seven gram rocks and finishing them because that's how i roll i have one speed i have one gear go fucking rocks The main thing I don't like about our riding area is just how much fucking rock it is. He roosted me again. He does that, she's like, I never roost anyone on purpose. Bullshit. I synced it. I synced it. Never a fan of this fucking rock garden. In fact, I'm gonna see if I can stop at some point and show, try to show how fucking steep this piece of shit is. Cause you can never tell from the camera. Fuck me. Why does this look so different? Fucking hell, man. I don't like that line. I'm taking this line. Fuck me. Ugh. Come on, baby. Don't do me dirty. Don't do me dirty. Treat Mikey right. All right. Okay. That is up. That's like straight fucking up. It's very difficult to show with any kind of camera. Let's see here. So let me see if I can hold the camera straight ahead. Okay. You can kind of see the angle of the slope. I'm telling you, man, I gotta crane my neck upwards to look up this shit. It's fucking steep. Anyway, all this shit's hard to catch on camera. Maybe you can see relative to me behind there. 
how steep that bitch is, but anyhow, that's enough. I'm in the hover position, like when you use a toilet at a Valero station. Trust me, you don't want to bare ass those things. When I was 12, my best friend bare assed the toilet at Burger King in Anderson, and he got a rash on his ass. Got to use that gasket. If there's none there. You fabricate one out of some toilet paper. No rash. Yeah, this is the one we took before. Told you with Ralph and Lonnie. I know where I'm at. I'm in the woods. On trail in the woods. We're heading towards the woods. My impeccable sense of direction. I live in the hood, I ride in the woods. Had another officer involved shooting in my neighborhood the other day. So that's fun. Getting so used to hearing the helicopter overhead, I hardly notice it anymore. Whenever you're ready. Oh shit, this battery's at 1% too. What the fuck? Oh 